but he's not saying to look like him. Okay, but you got a channel, Athlean X, where all the thumbnails are him like hitting curls and stuff and showing his back striations and all that. I mean, it looks like a bodybuilding channel, doesn't it? A lot of guys don't even know, realize we have a woman's channel. He could come out right now and say, yeah, I faked those lifts and I'm sorry, done deal right there. And he'll probably lose out on just a small fraction of potential revenue. He's the biggest fitness YouTuber and no one is calling him out. Uh, is very reductionist when it comes to injuries or injury risk reduction. All this does is further cement the fact that he was using fake weights in the original videos and straight up lied about it. The biggest problem with that guy is that he doesn't know how to program, either for size or for strength. Women are already, you know, they're terrified of lifting for all the, you know, the common misconceptions and the myths out there. He thinks he's up on this cloud and he's looking down at everybody else and they don't matter. He's like, I don't give a shit about all of you because I have my fanboys that are going to support me no matter what I do, no matter what I say, and they're going to believe me 100% no matter what I say. Thanos did exactly what he said he was going to do. So when I'm done, Athlean X will have 10 million subscribers. It's just the time that we live in, and I feel like these videos need to be made. because he's been lying about his lifting of the weights, and so it's more likely that he's lying about his natty or not status.